and we're back. The motorcycle. So I should be able to climb over. Motorcycle is nothing but busted up junk now. So I can climb over there. Um, hospital in the horizon. I can see the hospital. I bet the Tantra was brought there after they arrested me. If there's any chance I might find some answers, this would be the place to start. Yeah, because... <clears throat> yeah, I, I didn't say it out loud, but that guy was uh, security, and he got me, and then cops came and arrested me, somebody took the body. Makes sense. Man. Poison Ivy. Can you climb Poison Ivy? Oh, there we go. Sunshine, like, direct. So, the device is lit up now. The light must have recharged it, so I guess it's working again. I, um, I wish I knew how to sort of uh, decide where I'm going, but... It's now into the past. Fire escape ladder is just too high to reach it and jump because now I'm inside a police station looking like a convict with my overalls. Screwdriver. Beautiful. I always wanted to learn how to ride. I grow my mustache and burns. Got a leather jacket and just live on the road. I'll be seeing a lot more of that if I don't get far away from here soon. It's locked. Slam lock? I'm not sure what that is. It's an umbrella. It's a little battered, but I want to find a shape. I think would be nice to just use it now when I'm walking past the police station because if I'm in the time where they just brought me in then it's just <laughs> weird walking around here cool are you well whatever I don't know if you can die here but I know I haven't, haven't had many great ones lately but this is a really stupid idea they're probably really looking for me Indeed. How is the poison ivy gone now? It's poison ivy. I don't think anyone actually planted this, but it got here anyway. F, so this is a hotel. I could go on the roof and then just find my way down. Let's just, I'll try to play this doing what I would probably do. <laughs> so I'm not going to start ringing bells and shit. So I have to start ringing bells and shit. Turgeon spells so homely. I'm still not sure if I'm imagining this whole thing. It screws with my had more than anything. Grab some pants. Whoever lives are great taste in threads. They look a little bit like 70s clothes, so I'm still still a little bit unsure of of uh, what's going on. But I'm like thinking things that'll spoil things. But I would imagine that the old guy was me.
and it's recharged again. So I could go back or forward. But I would love to just throw this over there and just climb. I'm actually, I maybe can't reach the bar tomorrow. Close. I can see the hospital. I bet the Tantra was brought here after they arrested me. Yes, yes. I mean, you're, you're out round about here, right? Maybe I just couldn't leave because I hadn't gone up the ladder. Station garage. Car. Could be coming out any minute. Whoops. I should put the other screen like on top. So that, that doesn't happen all the time. Right. So... Since I'm on this side of the wall, I could, if I press it and I'm out here, I don't know where I should press it. I, because if I, if I go on top of the hotel and I press it and then, you know, it's broken down or something, then I'll fall down. Over here, I'm at least outside. door is now open so whatever happened must have happened pretty quick after I was captured someone in here a nightstick and I think I just threw up a little <clears throat> I don't get it with cars into the dead people it's a policy that served me well so far Oh, I don't get in cars with dead people. Somebody had time to board that up, though. Right, so it's a powered garage door. Not gonna get in from there. And I can press this again. So I guess it... It has, like, two settings. It's either... A certain amounts to one direction and then a certain amount to another. Beat it to death with a stick. Alright. Damn. That was a good hint. It was too good. Cause, but I, I'm not sure if I could have... Uh, if I would have figured it out. Because I'm not in a time travel mood right now. Or, or like... Uh, uh, my, my brain is not focusing on time travel. But that hint just did it. If I, uh, probably, well, there's no one home. No one at least answered the door when I was ringing it. It's been a long time since this lamp has brought light to anyone's life. I wonder if I can open it from here. The key seems to have been broken off in the lock. Lock from the inside? Are you fucking kidding me? Odd outline. It's too dark to see anything. Yeah. Oh yeah, the lamp. It's gotta be here, right? Put the... plug it in. Curtains... I started a decorating company. Oh, shit. Uh, that's how it works. 
Wallpaper paste. Hmm. Wallpaper. Totally digging it. So there's a door behind that. Hang on. Oh, I mean, I'm not gonna pop. Can you, can you just use your hands? Oh. Hmm. Alright, so now I can move around here. So, let's go take care of the poison ivy first. I mean, I could drop the poison on it, or just like, dig it with this one. No. Oh yeah, he did mention that. That it, it's not planted, so... I don't know, just kicking it would have worked maybe, maybe it's too heavy, I don't know. Anyway, I did it. Next up, time travel. Man. That's sort of good, because then I can put it in the door here, I think. And there was one door. I was thinking if I can go back in, because there was that one door without the handle. So, I, I doubt that I had to choose between these two, but here we go. TV's ruined. Uh, window. The door's barred. TV. Special news bulletin. It's probably about me. Maybe. Government, uh, well, government denies any serious threat and assures us that the fatal incidents we've been reporting all morning are completely natural and unrelated. Nix is currently aboard the Air Force One's headed for an important but undisclosed meeting. Oh, however, his press communicate issued. As for the special news bullet, it seems like it's been a false alarm, folks. Look, no bringing the latest international news from Gregory Smith. What have you got for us, Greg? Flu pandemic, rising gas prices, and the latest news from the war. Vietnam. This is the sort of... There's a back alley I should be able to slip into. It's not too far down either. Unfortunately, there's another of those windows that don't open. We had we had a painting like this, I think. Yeah, at home when I was a kid. I didn't get it either. <laughs> I miss the time when paintings made sense, like the one with the where the dogs play poker. Yeah, that doesn't make sense to me. Okay. That didn't take too long, so we'll keep going. One chapter at a time. Broomhead. Renewing my old broom without filling out acquisition forms. But your life, my friend, is over. We really need to find a different line of work. Yeah. The air from the fan has a slight hint of fresh meat and cleaning supplies, so that's the butcher's. It's a butcher shop. I know property prices in this town are through the roof, but who in their right mind would open a butcher shop right next to a hospital? Yeah, I guess that's true. Can't get in there. 
for now, at least. Nice. Maybe before I go anywhere. Oh shit, it's cold. Yeah, I should check every area with the uh, huh. dust. I need something to open it. <clears throat> so that happened in the past. But that door is still closed. And did I check that apartment with... I didn't check that apartment with the time machine. Which I guess sucks. I need to remember to do that. Oh, crap. Let me use this. Try to pull it out. I, I feel like it might be possible that um, it's let's run from the ladder. I'm taking it with me. If anything survived this war, I'll be hungry by now and I need something to defend myself. And we had a katana and you threw it off. So. Yeah, I made it through those bars. Girders and rubble in the way. So it's a. Uh, How does it work? I'm in the dark now. There's some continuity errors here. I'm not sure if I can die, because um, it hasn't been... It hasn't been happening f yet in the first few, few episodes, but I think... So I'm thinking maybe I should paint myself with blood a little bit to get in there, but... What did he say about that? Like he's not picking it up. There must be a way to get the turbines out without anyone noticing it's gone. I take it from the future, bring it back. Sewer tunnel draft. Yeah. Bees. Oh, this is like a really bad idea, but it's dropping the hornets mm. into the No. No. New window in 65, and I thought a bee's nest and held onto the drain pipe for 35 minutes. Holy shit. <clears throat> I thought you get less al allergic. <laughs> Three dead people today. I should be able to stomach this by now. Burn the bees. Grab it without anyone noticing. I don't think anybody's noticing it when you're... I'm gonna make out a few words every time I raise his voice. He's clearly looking for someone. Well, probably me. So you're not going to take that. It's all turpentine. It's almost half full too. Grab it. Nobody's 
Corrosive and flammable. Is she coming over? I probably shouldn't run off with the whole bottle, though. The painter will notice it's gone. Great idea if I want to get... If I want to get caught or shot. I was thinking, like, if there's, uh... No light in the... If there's no light in the... Um, or fluid in the lighter. That's what I was gonna say. They're both smoking. So I need some kind of a container. I'm not sure if I've seen one, and I hope I didn't just mess it up. So I don't think I saw, maybe... Can you take the trash can? Run a bit. I can see the manhole cover there. Or the manhole. Maybe I missed something here. I don't think so, though. Okay. That makes sense. Bend them. Hmm. Interest is blocked. I can see the bottom of uh, one of those red dumpsters. Okay, I'm definitely missing something now. So we are officially stuck. And I hope it's not because of that window, the jump out of that window. Because I did not, uh, I didn't check it in another time. I checked it in the modern time. Who would have brought a container in there afterwards? here when I'm maybe just like rusted yeah bone saw okay I'm not sure a bone saw is good enough for metal but syringe of flammable stuff that I can squirt at the bees.
I love a time machine like this that because it just works so easy usually in, in movies and stuff time machines are really heavy to operate or they're you know limited in some some way this is limited in two places two directions but oh don't do it hope he's not gonna Right, so I just squirt it first and then burn it. That doesn't work. Oh, fuck. Are you kidding me? My plan was perfect. Squirt it with the flammable stuff and then light it on fire. Squirt it while lighting it and then it burns down and then you can wait for a couple minutes and then... It stung a little bit, but you'd be inside. Burn down the hospital. Just burn it down. Forget about it. Live in the future. Yeah, I mean, now I'm just going to start clicking because I don't know. It would be, wouldn't it? Um, I don't know if alcohol, like what, because it vaporizes. I don't know about turpentine, but if you like drop it on something and then go into the future, uh, something has changed. Like it has... It has like melted through or, or not melted through or just corroded something. Let me just try this because the lighter by itself is probably not enough. And I can't combine items, that's good to know. That doesn't make any sense. I'm not sure if paint burns, if it's setting fire to paint. I'm pretty sure I've done dumber things. Right now I can't think of it. Also, there's no real wind, so I want to get rid of those beads. I need to light something closer to the nest. Closer to the nest. the branch something because like it goes along this way can I kill this tree fill that Yes. I can't, I can't think of any way to use it. So the tree grows from somewhere around here. It's not this one. Maybe I missed something down here because I was rushing. Rushing. Oh, and, well, I don't think I should. <laughs> Wooden beams. Because I was thinking if I, if I come back to uh, the past and then uh, let me readjust my position a little bit. If I um, jump back to the past and then it has like a metal beam going through it, then I would die. I don't know. Like, this game it probably isn't going to do, do me like that. And I would imagine that you can't die 
Well, at least for now. Let's see what he says about that. Man. It's falling down. Well, what I'm, I'm, I'm thinking. I know it doesn't work, but I'm thinking. You just throw that stuff in there, set it afire, then it goes inside the building and starts burning. But, but to what end? Uh, I really don't know. because I was I was focusing on getting this done really fast but I think I should give that up now and I should focus on the game rather than rushing it I don't know I'm just so there's only a spark So yeah, why would I want to set fire to these in the past? And it's like, well, exactly. But does it say why would I want to set fire to this in the past? Or, or did I try the lighter? Yeah. They're both smoking, they both have lighters. Uh, can of paint, I can't do anything with it, I can't set it on fire, I can't push it, I don't think. I'm missing something really obvious here. trying to light the gate on fire. I'm trying to burn this fucking tree down, which is because I could probably just snap the branch. And now I'm just getting annoyed. Hornet's Nest Hospital main entrance. Drain. Get, uh... No! Feel a draft from the sewer below. So I can't really aim that well from up here. trying to do oh I think I just got it and I'm a dumbass squirt it from here I can't get it to fuck off burn these sure if this is like proper I think it's moon logic but it's sort of like uh, you know grab one of the sticks and drop it or 
or whatnot. But I guess the smoke is the thing that he's looking for. Yeah. I'm gonna get it. So now I don't want to. Uh, if I flip to the past now, they're gonna be standing right there. And that's game over. Um, it's not gonna work. But there is a car here. So if I can. If I need a quick exit, I can probably take that car. Something's alive in here, I think. Didn't think of that either. Can't use the time travel thing during the night. What I can do is turn the ambulance lights on and then they'll come here. Then I'll go, well, I'll call it spawning. I'll spawn back out there in the past and then I can walk and open the doors maybe. thinking I, I don't think it's possible but we'll see I was afraid that me uh, mechanic or whoever was that they were um, here now See if I can, like, if it needs one. So, this is not for distractions. Um, let's see if it, he says anything if I go out there. Yeah, on foot. Notes or nothing. Because there's a cop right there, so he's. I really do want to try to uh, spawn right here, but I think I'm far enough from them if I spawn back here. And I should have, should have, would have, should have. Oh, Monday, May 7th, 10th, Monday, May 17th, and it's gone. <coughs> so yeah, it happened on the same day, the same day then. So what is the voltage on a car battery? No idea, actually. But I'm thinking he is the guy that I'm looking for. I'll go uh, look around just a little bit.
taking huge, huge chances here, <laughs> just by uh, walking around. Okay, so. Dead. It was a long shot, but I kind of hope he has somehow survived. There's only one way to answer to get answers now. I guess I need to find out where he lives or lived. Hmm. Reginald Lambert, no address. They probably don't put stuff like that on these tags. I guess. There's a file number two. If we can get this uh, guy's medical file, I should be able to get his address. Reginald Lambert. I think this was locked. Oh, I locked from the outside. Mm. It's the lobby, right? Hmm. Medical file or... He said medical file, so it's probably medical file, but, you know, a cop might note something as well. I'll just check these now that I'm here. Because this medical file might be there too, although it looks ruined. No, I can't use it like that. Insula Grove, Lake Crichton. It's pretty odd. What do you say? Oops, he's 
said something about pretty far out of town, so I'm, I'm guessing it's why we sort of need the ambulance. Do I need to use the address with it? I just need the key for the ambulance. Huh. on the corpse. So I would imagine it's the uh, it's the medic. I don't think so. Have I missed something? take a key from the future and bring it back depends on the theory I guess <laughs> but uh, he's not gonna go out there the key is somewhere around here and I think I opened that door but I guess it shuts automatically or locks itself oh right I, I check that, but it's a little bit open now, but uh, go through a pandemic, I took your stapler. No. Maybe I've ignored the doctor too much out there. I'll just check this room real quick. I don't think it's down here anywhere, but... So I'll go out here. And then... that oh yeah sure put it in there now okay so I will leave this episode here once he's done driving here out on the road everything seems so normal same moon, same night sky. After an hour of driving, it's easy to forget all about that dead world back there. 
How could Lambert have survived, though? If he came from the future, how did he not die along with everybody else? I just saw his body in the morgue. Now I'm driving out to talk to him alive. How does that work? Do you just leave a copy of yourself every time you use the box? Is that it? Are there copies of me all over the place now? What if he's not there? What if I changed something and he's not alive at all? Maybe all of this has been completely pointless. Maybe there's nothing I can do after all. Maybe these will be my last days, along with everybody else's. Ugh, the thought ties my stomach in knots. No, I better just not think about it and carry on. Did I bring enough gas? God, I hope I brought enough gas. The island. All right, I'll leave it here. Although I will mention, uh, like leaving copies of yourself, if this is the same world over and over again, then you're not leaving copies because you're I've been flip-flopping back and forth in the same place. But if it always creates like a new world, a new timeline, then that would mean that it, it sort of, it, well, I'm not a physicist, but it doesn't really make sense to me in a way because then somebody would be, let's say that I would be, I would have this time machine. I would press it and then it didn't work. And I'd be like, fuck, it doesn't work. But actually, I, a, a copy of me left into another or created another whole new world or left into another dimension or world. And then I'd be there stuck. And if I press it again, will I be able to travel or is it broken or does the, does the device, the device travels with the guy. So the device just disappears from my hands. So it, it would sort of create this weird kind of uh, situation where um you would copy yourself into a new world and the device would sort of have to i guess if it would disappear it would transport with you into the new world so there would be a lot of people just pressing buttons or pressing a button and then having the device disappear even though it's worked before in a way So if that's how it works, it's a strange concept, <laughs> but uh, yeah, we'll figure it out. And also it's nighttime, so I can't use it now, but there's, there's one issue, which is that it was the 7th, 17th, uh, when the troubles happened, which we'll call them, uh, since we don't know what exactly happened. So that means that, um, that means that either the date wasn't like somebody didn't change the date on the in the hospital, which is very unlikely because I would imagine there's people there all the time and it might even be automated. But uh, yeah, we'll see. Uh, I'll leave it at this and I'll see you in the next one.